Ahoy salty dogs, Lenscap here, and today we're playing Star Maid. This is episode number 12. Ar har yar har me hearties, or something. So, uh, what's going on? I've been kind of building some stuff, kind of. Uh, mostly just working on production with our new factory. You became active in your faction and will earn... Okay, I'm getting fact faction points. Um, so what have we been working on? Mostly just refining materials. I have a ton of stuff here. Um, after this, Sapson um, and Parsine. Let's see, where's Parsine? Here it is. We've only got 42,000 of those. We've only got 24,000 of these. Only 720 of these. I, I need to find some more Surtees. Um, but anyway, really what I need is the black. The Nox? Nox? So whatever. Um, today, what are we doing today? Today, we're building drones. Uh, we want to design the drone that's going to be used in our next ship. Um, we may design the drone launcher as well, uh, but likely that will be next episode. I think we're going to spend most of the time today, <coughs> excuse me, actually building the drone itself. So let's see. I don't have anything in my inventory, so let's do a little bit of um, uh, item gathering, I guess. What do we need? We're definitely going to need Bobby AI because we're building drones. Uh, we need a ship core. We need a couple thrusters. Power reactors. Uh, we might need a few power reactors. I want some minor shields in it. Wow, we're already getting up to a lot of blocks here. Okay, weapon systems. What do we want? I want cannons. And I want uh, missiles. Do I have missiles? Um, I think we're going to do... Okay. I have an idea for this. Let's see. What other things do we need? I don't need a faction module. Don't need gravity. Don't need any of these blocks. I think that's all we need for this. Uh, hull. We'll need some hull. Let's just take gray hull. Uh, for now, and then maybe we'll color it. Um, we'll build it out of gray, and then we'll add colors later. That's the plan. All right, so let's fly away from this guy a little bit so our frames don't suffer too terribly. Uh, wow, <laughs> that's a big difference. And we'll spawn out. Let's spawn it here. We're going to call this the Hornet. 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 Um... We'll call it the Hornet Drone. Okay. And there's kind of our ship. So let's hop into build mode. The front is to our left. Let's actually fly a little bit further away for a frame, you know, frame rate kind of options. Okay. What? Uh, oh, okay. I don't think I was in the ship. Whoops. <laughs> let's hop back in this puppy. Now, here, let's go ahead and do this. We're just going to put, let's see, the front is that way. We're just going to put a power reactor and a thruster on it so it's a little bit faster. Hop back in. There we go. Now we can fly away. Okay, I have a design idea for this. And good thing I brought some hull with me to kind of flesh that out. Okay, yeah, that'll work, that'll work. So, what do we want? Um, we definitely want the cannons. Uh, we need the Bobby AI to be accessible. Now, I think I'm going to put that on the stinger of the thing. Yeah, it's called a Hornet. It's going to look like a Hornet. That was my plan. Okay, uh, cannon computers. Do we want multi, like, rapid-fire cannons? think we might. Uh, we might just do standard cannons, though. I haven't decided on that one quite yet. But what do we definitely need? We definitely need power. Let's do two things of power. We're going to do one shield capacitor and one recharger. We don't need a lot of shields, but I do want some shields on it. 330 shields is not a lot. Uh... Uh, well, we definitely need recharger if we're going to have a capacitor. Yeah, that'll be fine, though. We don't need a lot of shields, so... 
Okay, what else do we want? Uh, we want cannons. Uh, I think I will go with the rapid cannons. So we'll do cannons there and there. Okay, what other things do we want? Oh, I forgot docking. Uh, we need to put docking on it. How much shields... How much power do we regen? Uh, it's not super quick, but we don't need it to be super quick. If we just have one, we'll have it dock from the top. Yeah, yeah, that's the plan. And actually, the docking module can go on the shell on top of it, so that'll be fine. Okay, what else do we need? Uh, we need thrusters. I'm just going to put one thruster there, and I think that does it for the body of our beast. Okay, so now what do we do? Now we want to shell the puppy. Uh, how much of a shell do we really want for this? We don't need a big deal. Let's actually, let's turn on symmetry. Um, we don't need a lot of shell, really, because uh, it's just a drone. But I do want it to look fairly nice. And let's see, can we put, should we put something on the front like this? Whoops, not there, there. Um, kind of wasp looking or hornet, it is called a hornet. Okay, yeah, that'll be cool. And then we need access to the core, so we'll leave that open. Uh, but let's do put the kind of tetra or whatever they're called here. And then we'll just put a block there, a full block. And then our docking module will go there. And then here, let's do... Uh, let's do a full block here. And let's see, we could put... No, let's see. How do we want this? We'll put full blocks there and there. Then we can put corners... Uh, we could put corners like this. I need the corner, yeah. Come on, the corners are always hard to find the right kind of positioning for it. That looks like it's a half. That is a, that's a wedge. I thought I had the corners. Okay, there's the corner. Uh, let's, and then I want a wedge kind of like, like that. Maybe? Is that hornet shaped? Does that look like a bee? Kind of. Kind of it looks like a bee. When we get black and uh, black and red on it, it, it will look more like a bee. Okay, so what else do we want? Um, let's, let's do... Should we mirror this along the bottom as well? Maybe that'll look better. Okay, and what if we do our, uh, our kind of tail shape in the same fashion like that um yeah that could be okay we want to flip these around though i think that's what i just had uh where's the inverse of that one is it come on come on come on come on there yeah that'll that's cool that's cool, and then we'll put one as well, like that. That's kind of B-shaped. Okay, and then we'll take our wedges, and we want to do here and here. We've got our kind of soft corner here. Yeah. And then we can almost, let's put, let's try this here. Kind of snub-nosed a little bit. Yeah. I like that. All right, now we have the triangle here, the hard corner. Uh, I think we do the hard corner again. I think that's going to work the best. Okay. Yep, that looks good. Now, uh, now we want... Let's see. What do we want? We want wings and a stinger. So, kind of for the wings, I was thinking we do kind of like a, like an angly, 
kind of thing like this and we can do a full block like that um, and we'll stick it out one further uh, I need wedges and okay come on wedge where's my wedge shape that's the one I want and let's put one uh, like this okay yeah that works this is gonna be a little bit bigger of a drone but that's cool okay now the Canon computers uh, oh the Canon computer hmm alright so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna remove one of these power guys and put the Canon computer there oh I have one right Canon Canon that's right I have the cannons already so uh, let's we'll put this back um, and I'm gonna leave that open so I can get to the computers for now let's put the power back because I'm gonna need that and there's our primary cannon computer so I wanted the multi like the rapid firing cannons I wanted to do like this two cannons and we'll select the other computer and put out two more cannons like that and then we'll take the main computer and slave the second computer off now I want the main cannons to be in the back because if these get destroyed then these can still shoot okay so that's a cool shape uh, let's put thrusters because we want these suckers to be fast they are called hornets we want thrusters all over the freaking place we may just leave those cannons exposed as well. Uh, they don't have to be strong, right? These are more, those are kind of like its mouth, right? Like it, like if it bites you. Um, in fact, we could almost do the cannon there and just have the wings as just wings. Uh, but let's arm it to the teeth, guys. It's a, it's a hornet, so let's arm it. Okay, that looks good. What if we... Okay, what if we removed these and put thrusters like that? And then we could kind of take this corner block and put it in this way. Yeah, that works. And then we've got a little bit more thrust. I always like to have more thrust. So can these also support here, let's undo because I like that shape actually uh, and I was thinking about putting more like fins like this uh, but I don't think that's necessary we might want to though and we're gonna change all these colors to yellow and black I think uh, no so it looks more like hornet shaped okay next we want the stinger now the stinger is going to come off the bottom like this. So uh, actually what we want is, let's take these wedges again. And we want kind of this one. And we want to this one. Nope, that's not right. I think we want a full block maybe. Let's see. Yep, and then we want another wedge. Uh, how low do we want the stinger to be? This kind of determines how big our drone bay has to be. I think that'll work though, and we'll put a full block there. In fact, let's put the cannon, let's put the first, uh, where are my missiles? They're in here. We're going to do missiles on the stinger, and we'll put the first missile computer there. And let's cover that up a little bit. We're going to put a wedge there yeah this is looking sharp and we can actually remove that wedge because that's where we're gonna start putting cannons uh, missiles I mean we're gonna do the same thing with the missiles let's actually let's stack these computers like that and then we'll do two missile tubes and then select this computer and do two more missile tubes like that now here's the thing if we put armor on top then there's not gonna be enough room so we need to drop this down another 
at least one more. So let's do that real quick. Where's our angle, our wedge? And this is just a drone, so it doesn't have to look super sharp, but it's, uh, but I think this is gonna be a really cool looking drone. So we actually need to get rid of that because we're gonna put armor there. And we'll just do kind of straight blocks uh, like this because we know that that's what it's gonna look like. Um, we'll do our two missile computers here and here. And then this one gets two tubes, and then this one gets two tubes. Just like that. I like it. Okay, uh, let's kind of outfit this missile so it looks like a stinger. Um, let's find there. Yep, that'll work. Now how are we going to do the very back here? I think we do like this and we'll just make it uh, square here kind of round it off let's go ahead and put in all of our our standard blocks then just the regular blocky ones and then we'll put the detail on after so like that that looks kinda heavy we're just gonna leave the cannons exposed like that too I don't know man hmm what if we continue the wings a little bit? What could we do? More blocky? I'm trying to think B. I don't like that. I liked it better like that. I think we'll just leave them exposed. Um, let's actually, let's put a thruster here. And then we want to put our wedges. Yeah, we definitely want to use wedges here. That'll work. It looks vaguely like a wasp. What if we put a full block here? No, I like the uh, I like the angle better. Okay, we're gonna need a wedge here for sure. Yeah, and on the front, a couple more wedges. Let's get the right orientation there. And we need one more, that one? Nope, that one. Nope, whoops, not that one. Not that one either. Uh, that one, that's what we want. There we go, that's kind of our shape. Okay, now let's grab the, we gotta keep wedging. Wedgies, wedgies, uh, wedgies are important. <laughs> For, uh, for these so there's there and the underside is the mirror of that so uh, nope that one like that so it kinda looks like a pod the missiles are our important weapon the guns are mostly just uh, kinda cheese or icing on the cake or whatever let's drop these wedges on top before I forget about it and we'll put our docking module uh, there in that hole, and it'll dock from the top. Okay, what else do we need? We need to fill out these. We're just going to use our, our smooth corners, our soft corners. There, and we need the inverse. There. And we'll do soft corners on the front as well. There, and the inverse, uh, which is that one. Alright, and I like that. I think I'm going to finish this out with a stinger, like uh, some black paint cans. Just kind of maybe three or four long, so it looks like it's got a stinger. I think that's going to be our drone. We'll probably switch out the gray with black and yellow to make it look more B-shaped. I might even get rid of... I think it looks like a B. I think I did a great job. I think it looks like a bee. These wings could be a little bit more mass. So let's do this. Let's try this. And wedge and wedge. Yeah, I think that's a little better. We could even do uh, just a flat block there. That's even a little bit better. 
How's she fly? Oh, I, I hopped out. So she turns quickly. Good. She's a bee. Accelerates and decelerates quickly. Let's get weapon systems. Oh, I forgot to... Here, let's, let's fix the missiles real quick. Um, let's see... Okay, C, V. Okay, and then can we undo the blocks now? Yeah! Let's hop back in. Let's fix our guns. Let's fire guns. Cannons are good. They're constantly firing. That's what I want. They don't have to be strong. They're a distraction. Look at that missile. Oh, don't hit my ship, please. Where are they going? Please don't... Oh no. You did. Okay, cannot attack a faction on base. Okay, good. <laughs> and I'm docked, so no worries. <laughs> oh, that had me nervous. And those are going towards the pirates. Alright, but let's see. And I didn't notice how much uh, energy that took, so I'm going to shoot one more time. And that didn't take nearly very much of our energy at all, actually. So that works great. Uh, let's orient ourselves. Yeah, I like the little Hornet drones. I think that's going to work for us. Uh, the missile pod's a little big. Not much really we can do about that, though, except... Let's see, what could we do about it? We could cut these back by one on all sides. And then maybe it'll look more Stinger-esque. Let's try that. That'll give us a little bit more uh, maneuverability as well. Because we'll be a little bit lighter. It's not going to be significant, but it's going to be a little bit. And we need our soft corner. Okay, we already have that one selected. And we need this one. Uh, yeah, that'll be good. And then we'll put some black paint cans, which I'm out of black paint cans right now. But uh, we'll put some black paint cans on the end of those puppies to make it look more like a, like a stinger. And I think that's going to be our drone. Let's see. Yeah, the Hornet. Uh, okay, what else do we need, though? Uh, a docking camera would be nice. Um, just for when we have to dock these guys. So, did I bring cameras? I didn't. We'll probably put the docking camera here pointing upwards. Because um, I didn't bring the dock either. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. Let's hop back in the, guy, in the thing. Uh, lens cap. You're a terrible pilot. We'll fly down and kind of set. Oh my gosh, she's so nimble and quick, and I love it. Okay, we'll fly down like this. How tall is she? Here, let's orient with the station so we can just kind of drop ourselves like this. Okay. So there's, there she is. Oh man, I did a great job docking right in the middle. Okay. Uh, okay, let's grab camera and a docking thing. Uh, let's see, rail docker. So we want that. Uh, now we are going to dock from the top, which is a little bit interesting and different. Why are there thrusters in there? Oh, because I just swapped. Okay. And we'll grab a camera. They're a little bit bigger than I wanted. Let's see if I have any paint cans. I think I have paints in this one. Yeah. Oh, and I do have some black ones. Cool. So let's just put... Uh, let's hop into build mode because it's easier. And then we'll f we're actually going to fly away from this a little bit because the frame rate thing is a problem. 
and we'll put the tip on the stinger let's do that we'll set up our rail docker and let's build mode okay here's paint cans we're just gonna do like two or three maybe oh my gosh that looks awesome definitely looks like a stinger to me and okay and our rail docker goes here let's make sure it's facing the right way needs to look up and forward yep there we go and do we need a docking camera? I mean, we kind of do, don't we? Oh, and I don't have the Bobby AI on there at all. Whoops. We need the Bobby AI accessible too, so I think we're going to put that on the bottom. Uh, and it doesn't matter which way it faces. We'll put that there. And let's get our cameras out. There's our camera. It needs to face upwards. Does that actually matter? I know an easy way to test it. T, so we can get the rail docker on the bar. And we'll switch cameras. And if we shoot the rail docker, yeah, it does matter. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know you could aim it. That's nice. Uh, now, if that's to my left, then the camera is actually facing that way. Can we change this? orientation of the camera by looking uh, or can is it just basically just up I don't think we can I think it's just up lens cap your terrible pilot okay that'll work that that's better That'll work for us. Let's check out the weapon systems one more time. I want to fire the... Wait a minute. Are we in the... Are we not in the core? There we go. Now we're in the core. Okay. Oh, and we can file the rare... We can fire the rail docker from here. Hmm, so maybe we don't need that camera on top. Where did those missiles even go? Oh, they're headed after the pirate ship. Okay, but I have plenty of energy for them. That's good. That's very good. And I'm not factioned, uh, I'm not factioned on this drone because I don't have to be. It's going to be docked to a faction ship. So that doesn't matter. Let's do colors next. I'm going to do colors off camera because that's, uh, you already watched me build it once. No sense in watching me build it twice. Let's do colors and then check it out. Here she is in her final form. The, uh, the Hornet drone. Um, let's fly away a little bit because these frame rates right around this giant station ship are pretty miserable. All right, so let's uh, build mode and take a look at her. I really like how this turned out. It totally looks like a hornet. Uh, <laughs> I think that's awesome. That's going to be so intimidating when she goes and, and feasts upon the, the blood of my enemies <laughs> or whatever. Uh, do hornets feast upon blood? I don't think they do, but they have a pretty nasty sting, and uh, that's kind of the idea of this thing. You know, a little bit of cannons. I even honestly could do without the cannons. They don't have to have the cannons. The missile is probably enough. Um, I really like that it's a cluster missile and uh, it heat sinks. I, it kind of uh, seeks targets. Um, that works out really well. But I feel like the cannons are just icing on the cake. You know, the primary weapon is the missile. Uh, but she needs to be able to whittle away at shields or at least, you know, get distractions. Um, the idea is that the Hornet is going to distract the enemies from my main ship um, as, we, uh, as, we, as we launch them. Uh, I'm going to have several of these too, so it's going to be like a swarm. I think that'll be really cool. Um, so I have an idea for the main ship, uh, what it's going to look like. Um... The Hornet turned out way different than I expected it would, but I really like the way it looks. So there's uh, there's our drone. That's awesome. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. 
Um, I am LensCap. Please leave a like if you like the ship or the video or anything that I'm doing here. Uh, they help me out so much. And um, I'll see you guys in the next episode.